Sometimes you get annoyed, don't you, when you're playing a game and it suddenly lags. Well, in this video, I'll give you a tutorial on how to overcome lag or crashes when playing the game Wuthering Waves. Here, I tested using a Samsung A54, and later I will show you the best settings that I often use. So, for friends who want to play more smoothly, just watch it until the end, don't skip it so you don't miss anything. So, the causes of lag in the game can vary, friends. It could be because the processor on your cell phone, or the temperature of your cell phone being too hot. In fact, it could also be because the game settings are not suitable for the type of processor you are using. So, here I will show you the settings that I use, and you can try an example. In my opinion, the comfortable setting on my cell phone, namely the Samsung A54, is graphics quality on medium. For the frame rate, I only set it at 45 FPS, don't use 60 FPS because it will make the game heavier. So, why did I turn off anti-aliasing? This is so that the cell phone's performance is not too burdened and it doesn't make the cell phone hotter. So, friends, you can try this setting, who knows, it might also be suitable for your cell phone. Anyway, this setting makes playing smoother without making your cell phone burn out. In my opinion, this game is quite difficult, yes, because it is an open world game. But, don't worry, friends, you can try tinkering with the graphics settings to overcome the lag. Indeed, we have to experiment ourselves to find the settings which is the most comfortable for playing this game. Try it first, starting from medium or low graphics quality, then adjust it to your cell phone's performance. Hopefully with this experiment, you can get a smoother and more enjoyable playing experience. Oh yes, I remind you again, in my opinion using a fan cooler is really effective. You see, if the cell phone temperature is too hot, its performance will definitely decrease. So, for heavy games like this, my advice is to use a fan cooler for your cell phone. That way, the cell phone temperature can remain stable, and the game will also run smoother. I hope this advice is useful, okay? See you in the next tutorial video friends.